Hello viewers, welcome back to my channel. I am Sister Galkidan. In today's video, I will mention what gastritis is, the cues, diagnosis, medical treatment, and home remedies. So keep watching till the end of the video. If you are new for this channel, please consider subscribing. What is gastritis? Gastritis is an inflammation, irritation or erosion of the lining of the stomach. It can occur suddenly or acute or gradually, which is chronic. What causes gastritis? Gastritis can be caused by irritation due to excessive alcohol use, stress, chronic vomiting, or the use of certain medications such as aspirin or other anti-inflammatory drugs. It may also be caused by one helicobacter pylori or H. pylori, a bacteria that lives in the mucous lining of the stomach. Without the treatment, the infection can lead to ulcers and in some people it may cause stomach cancer. Two, Bile reflex, a backflow of bile into the stomach from the bile tract that connects to the liver and gallbladder. 3. Infections, infections caused by bacteria and viruses. If gastritis is left untreated, it can lead to severe loss of blood and may increase the risk of developing stomach cancer. What are the symptoms of gastritis? Symptoms of gastritis vary among individuals and in many people there are no symptoms. The most common symptoms include nausea, abdominal pain, abdominal bloating, vomiting, indigestion, hiccups, loss of appetite, vomiting blood or coffee ground like materia, black or tarry stools are common symptoms of gastritis. How to diagnose gastritis? To diagnose gastritis, your doctor will review your personal and family medical history, perform physical evaluation and may recommend the following tests. 1. Upper endoscopy. An endoscopy is a thin tube containing a tiny camera. It is inserted through your mouth and down into your stomach to look at stomach lining. The doctor will check for inflammation and may perform a biopsy. Biopsy is a procedure in which a tiny sample of tissue is removed and then sent to a laboratory for analysis. 2. Blood test. The doctor may perform various blood tests such as checking your red blood cell count to determine whether you have anemia which means that you didn't have enough red blood cells. They can also screen for H. pylori infection. 3. Stool test. This test checks for the presence of blood in your stool, a possible sign of gastritis. What is the treatment for gastritis? Treatment of gastritis depends on specific cues. Medications used to treat gastritis include one antibiotic medication to kill H. pylori. For H. pylori in your digestive tract, your doctor may recommend a combination of antibiotics or triple therapy, such as clarithromycin and amoxacillin or mitrandazole to kill the bacteria. Be sure to take full dose properly, usually for 7 to 14 days. 2. Medications that block acid production and promote healing. Proton pump inhibitors reduce acid by blocking the action of the parts of the cells that produce acid. These drugs include omiprazole, lansoprazole, rabiprazole, pantoprazole, and others. Long-term use of proton
ketone pump inhibitors, particularly at high doses, may increase your risk of hip, wrist, and spine fracture. Ask your doctor whether a calcium supplement may reduce this risk. 3. Medication to reduce acid production. Acid blockers, also called histamines, H2 blockers, reduce the amount of acid released into your digestive tract, which relieves gastritis, pain, and encourages healing. Acid blockers include famotidine, semetidine, and nizatidine. The fourth one is medications that neutralize stomach acid. Your doctor may include antiacid in your drug regimen. Antiacids neutralize existing stomach acid and can provide rapid pain relief. This helps with immediate symptom relief, but are not generally used as a primary treatment. Proton pump inhibitors and acid blockers are more effective and have fewer side effects. Hey viewers, wait, let us move to common home remedies to treat gastroids. Number 1. Yogurt. Yogurt contains probiotics that keep the digestive system healthy. Probiotics are good microorganisms that kill harmful bacteria and improve digestive health and regulate bowel movement. They can also inhibit the progression of the stomach infection caused by H. pylori bacteria. Number 2. Turmeric. Turmeric contains both antioxidants and anti-inflammatory properties the help in gastric treatment. Number 3. Garlic. Garlic possesses antimicrobial properties that inhibit the growth of Helicobacter pylori. Consuming raw crushed garlic extract helps manage gastrites and reduce gas formation. Number 4. Broccoli. This beneficial vegetable contains a chemical compound that has antibacterial properties. The compound is known to help relieve gastritis symptoms. Number 5. Papaya. This fruit is loaded with antioxidants and also has an enzyme called papain that helps in the digestion of protein. Papaya is also known to reduce the formation of gas. Number 6. Ginger. Ginger has antioxidant and anti-inflammatory properties. It helps reduce inflammation and irritation of the stomach lining. Number 7. Whole grains. Whole grains are excellent in helping the body fight inflammation. This promotes digestive health and help in managing gastrites. This includes oats, brown rice, whole wheat bread. Okay viewers, to conclude, lifestyle modifications for gastrites treatment is mandatory. So, eating small and frequent meals, quitting smoking, reducing caffeine and alcohol consumption, managing stress and avoiding overuse of painkiller is better. Thank you for watching. For more health videos, please subscribe to my channel.